In terms of the investigation, Kent Police were called shortly after four o'clock on Tuesday of this week to the edge of Ackholt Wood on the outskirts of Snowdon Village. That is where we found Julia. She was deceased. The Serious Crime Directorate have commenced a murder investigation. We do not, at this stage, have any identified suspects. We are keeping all options open to us while we fully investigate the circumstances of this matter and try to understand exactly what happened. We do not, at this stage, understand the motive for this attack. I would like to appeal, please, for witnesses. Many local and wider members of the community have come forward with incredibly useful, important information that is helping us piece together what happened on Tuesday. If anybody else saw anything suspicious or strange on Tuesday or Wednesday of this week, we're very, very anxious to, to speak to them. Um, we're very, very grateful for the support that we've received from the local community. They've been incredibly patient. We have a lot of police officers in, in the location. That will continue in, into the weekend while we continue our investigations and we continue um, our searches um, seeking evidence. I do understand that local um, residents are, are concerned. That, that's completely natural. Um, as stated, I do not at this stage um, have an identified suspect. We do not know what the motive for this attack is. I would urge people, if they have any concerns, to report it to Kent Police immediately. People should be cautious and aware of their surrounding um, circumst um, circumstances and situation. Julia uh, was not on duty at the time of this incident. She was not in uniform. As uh, with many people in the current climate, um, she was working from home that day. Um, she was walking her dog, as I say, out of uniform, um, and we're still um, seeking to establish exactly what happened. A post-mortem took place on Thursday of this week, um, and I can confirm um, that she died as a result of serious head injuries.